previously on Yaxa 3 Remastered. Well, thank you for talking to me again. I really appreciate it. Let me feel like I can get through, a, get through this somehow. Here, here, son. I'd like you to have this. It's a gun. Use it to put me out of my misery. Oh, for God's sakes. And now back to Yaxa. Hey, Nico. Yeah? What's that? What's what? Tiger drop. <laughs> oh! Sneaker B, back with some more Yaxa 3 Remastered. When we last left off, we helped Izumi befriend little doggy, and uh, also did a few more of the sub-stories. We are at least starting to get down to uh, the nitty-gritty here, although I think there's still uh, a few other sub-stories that don't show up on the map. Um, and also, apparently, I think you guys said that before we get to leave, a few more sub stories are going to pop up as well. So, which I may just tackle now. I know, I know you guys probably already started getting sick of sub stories. I had like two episodes of them, but apparently we don't come back to Okinawa for a long time. And I don't really know exactly how uh, the whole Amon thing is going to work. Do I, would I find him here? Would I find him in Kamurocho? Pro probably Kamurocho. I think I said you can't actually go back and forth freely till the end of the game or maybe even a premium adventure. I don't know. I got to. I gotta figure that out. But there's still be a few we have left, including one that I actually have to, I actually have to play a game of golf in order to get. And also the hostesses, which uh, you guys did say, apparently the hostess mini game in this game is not nearly as good as like Yakuza 0 or Kwame 2. So I might cut out a good chunk of it. I, I don't know, I kinda need to see it. I need to see exactly what it entails. My, what I'm imagining then is that a lot of it is going to be like, the girls are just cut cardboard cutouts of each other and you have just doing the same shit again and again and they say the same shit again and again like they don't have personalities it's gonna be hard for me to skip over them if they actually have like story arcs or actual personalities but uh if it's just the case that no it's just like they're doing the same stuff kind of like with the um the girls that i'm actually training for the the other hostess mini game right uh ended up being right where it like each one is they have no personality right you just train them and then it's gonna end the same way every time and you get some money i wouldn't be surprised if that one's the same way but i do at least want to see it and you know show a little bit of on on screen before i make a decision on that but i think for now we'll probably just keep going with the main story until we get to the point where we are going to be heading out oh by the way you guys to tell me the the dog that uh was in kwame one uh, apparently they actually let it go at the end of the, the first game. And then apparently in Kwame 2, I don't remember this, but there was a sub story where a homeless guy gets, is found to be taking care of the dog or something. Um, so that's cool. I, I got, I didn't remember that unless it was just in the original Yaxa 2 game and not in Kwame 2, but it's kind of been a while since Kwame 2. So, but okay, good, good. Glad. The other dog's doing fine. Now we've got new Shiba dog. It's always a Shiba, right? Seriously. What is up with Japan and their Shibas? Even in like Phoenix Wright, it was always a Shiba in that game too. Shibas are the most popular, memeiest dog in existence. Right up there with Frenchies. <laughs> Pretty looks at me. Hey. Uh, but anyway, last episode, uh, the Brawl Bros said, uh, Kiryu, it's those girls again. What are rumors that are they talking about this time? Miwako, you guys want to talk about boys some more? Just some high school romance. No point listening. Wait, why can't I leave? What's going on? This conversation is looping. How do I get out of here? <laughs> Hiyori first time <laughs> uh i feel bad for any people who didn't watch the 13 sentinels let's play or has to play the game itself to know the pain the pain of that shit oh my god sorry kiryu you're gonna be stuck in there for the next like fucking half hour trying to figure out what the dicks the game wants you to do sub story endless Bam, brr, it just keeps doing this out every time restarting it again and again no no let me out let me out Yakuza. let me out but bro bro thank you so much for your hilarious and hopefully doesn't come true comment and it's for that reason you are comment of the day <laughs> so the final one of these um these uh mysteries is gonna be is uh the mysteries of ryukyu is this endless time loop of listening to the schoolgirls talk about mysteries of ryukyu but okay so uh we found a little doggy uh yuzumi became best friends with him fairly quickly and he bit the bad yaksa people and now we're heading back so i like it really soon like we were, we were just like the next morning we're just getting the shit out of here back to kamurocho and it's like nah just kidding what are you talking about <laughs> carrie's got some other goofy shit to do god i really do wish that i oh god uh i really wish i had unlocked a freaking sprint button when i was chasing after that dog Come on, game. That was the best time they could. You could have done it. I'm just starting to think Kira's being lazy. I don't want to run in this game, Nico. Just gonna do my nut, my nice brisk morning jog. Probably be a real, a real man, Kira. You just get a fucking car. Just fucking drive somewhere yourself. Run over pedestrians like a real GTA game. Because Kiryu doesn't kill anybody. It's fine, Kiryu. It's fine. Just run them over. They'll go flying. They'll be fine though, right? Because Kiryu, I, I actually legitimately think Kiryu just can't kill anybody. Hey, it's Ricky up. 
An AK. Rick, yeah. What are you doing over here? Well, you, you said we are going to be shipping up to Comrade and I, but I realized we never agreed on time. Ah, shit. I was going to dump you, actually. Figured I'd stop by and check with you. Oh, ah, uh, fuck. The fly will be at eight, I guess. You yeah, guess? Shouldn't you have booked book by now? Uh, hey, and hey, that's pretty late. I'm not going to get into Tokyo until 11. That's that's fine. Comrade never sleeps after all. Good point, Aniki. Oh, and I'm all packed and ready to go. The trip's going to be great. We're not going to have fun, Rikio. This is all business, all right? I know there's probably like 100 sub stories waiting there for us, but we're going to ignore all of that and just go main story the entire game. Fuck them out. It's not worth it. Yeah, yeah, I know. Anyways, we've got some time until we got to head out for the 8 o'clock flight. Guess I'll just chill here for an hour. Right, uh, good idea. By the way, Nikki, take a gander over there. Mm. Mitsuo and Riona, what about them? Someone's got a mean case of young love to catch me. I'm not sure I do catch you. Just watch, yeah? Hey, Riona, you know a cop from school? His dad's like mega rich. Apparently he owns three old movie theaters in town. Did you know mm. that? Yep. Oh, well anyway, me and a cop were talking and he gave me two free tickets for a movie in one of his dad's theaters. Uh-huh. Or she didn't beat, beat the tickets out of him? What? Of course not. Yeah, sure. Anyway, sure those tickets are only good till today. Can you believe it? <laughs> what? Beat the, the hell? Has this kid been beating the other kids up? Now look, if I don't go now, what should I do? Um, just go? Well, I, I want to go, but no, my friends can do it. Uh, huh. Can't you just go alone then? But, damn. Wow. <laughs> this kid's super awkward. But, Rihanna, will you go with me? Sorry, I have plans. Huh? Huh? What kind of plans? Don't you have a movie to get to? Maybe Cher or one of the other guys would want to go. Oh, um, yeah. Holy fuck. Now she's gonna do her weird, awkward kid walk off to the side. Actually, wow, wow, that's gotta hurt. Yeah, Jesus. Not surprised with those clothes, though. Not sure you're the one to be critiquing fashion, Rika. You wear the same dumb shirt every day. So do you. This is our first game of wearing this shirt, all right? Don't you comment on it. <laughs> now, come on, just look at this le luscious hair. Not a single strand out of place. Yeah, because it's one solid block. <laughs> it's one solid polygon. Hold up, Aniki. Deep, deep. Not like how I look. Eh, whatever. <laughs> Guess just behind the times. You don't like what? I thought you thought I was beautiful. Aniki, excuse me. Gotta accept that fashion changes, old timer. I know more fashion than you do. Oh, God. Sure you do, Aniki. Hey, why don't we have a little friendly contest? You know, see who's really got the best taste. A fashion contest, huh? South Charlie, you're gonna regret this. You're gonna fucking regret this, Ricky. I will fucking smoke you. I'm gonna make you regret Charles Mirror. Yeah! <laughs> I will kill you in your sleep, Ricky. Yeah, <laughs> sure you are, Nikki. Sure you are. All right, here come the rules. Each of us is gonna pick out some stuff that really make Misua's style pop. One clothes on him and one accessory. Got it? Yeah. Good. Then let's regroup back here when we got him. I'm gonna whoop your ass to high heaven, Nikki. I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. I swear, fuck. I don't always end up agreeing to these absurd requests. I do want to help Masuo, though, because I'll play along. Damn, all right, we're, st we're still going with this shit. All right. <laughs> we are really stretching out my stay here before I head out. Hi, doggy. Hello. Aw. Uh, oh, I can't pet the dog. Ah, uh, zero out of ten. M man, that sucks. Is that bagel? Bagel sucks. So what do I do? I have to head into town? Maybe it still look cool. It must be a good shop downtown. Let's go. I'm just going to do it and not tell him about it. Uh, yeah, I kill you, son. I couldn't help it over here. Damn it, my, it's my nosy neighbor, Flanders. <laughs> my hi, diddly oh, neighbor. It's you going out on another adventure? Man, fuck off, Flanders. Oakley, Oakley. I see a guy who really does like Flanders, now I think about it. Oh, well, over here, you and the fire, flowery man, Ricky Akun, was it? You want to make Masu Akun more popular with the ladies, yes? Uh, yeah. I just don't know a whole lot about latest trends, though. I was going to window shop a bit downtown. I uh, see. In that case, recommend a shopping store. Shop, shop it in the store right near the big big old intersection. I never actually stepped foot in that place myself, but one of the resident neighborhood wives, wives seemed very keen on the products. All right, I'll go to shop. Thanks, Miyara son. Let's go. I'm going to pimp out this little guy. Get my fucking tux and a gun. Yeah, ladies like guns and a Maserati. Hey, you know what? I don't like your face. I'm going to get inside your face. Good for you, dude. Good for you. This place? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hello there, sir. What can I help you with? Hopefully a lot. I'm looking for some children's clothes. Maybe an accessory to go with them. Just a moment, sir. Let me show you what we have in our stock. Pretty limited selection. What should I pick? 
An American flag polo. <gasps> dragon print! <laughs> Fucking badass dragon. Well, I'll take that dragon print polo. Nothing quite like a dragon! Exit choice, sir, for the accessory. My two options again. I guess I'll go with a 10 gallon hat, fucking sunglasses, bitch. So I can go like all American or all just like Kiryu Joe Amon. Go with the sunglasses. Not much cooler than that. Get some aviators for this kid. That gets, huh? All right. 2,000 yen. Fuck you. I got my kind of money. All right. Here we go. Yeah, hey, items, huh? We're so stylish clothes. Thank you for stopping by. All right, now to get home and show Ricky what's what. I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of him just like I beat this guy up over here. Yeah, I still said he's in the hospital. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Cry. So quit crying, all right? It's just like 10 gallons of lost blood, all right? Get over it. All right, Ricky, I'm gonna show you. Uh, Nikki, ready to get the fashion beat down? Actually, I'm pretty confident. How are you feeling, Ricky? Oh, uh, you don't know. You gotta worry about me. I'll be just fine. Anyway, let me go grab Mitsu. Ha, ha, ha. So much fun. What do you losers want? <laughs> We're back, Aniki. What is it, Uncle Kaz? I'm not really feeling so good. You'll feel better soon, Miss Oa, when I make you into a fucking dragon. We're going to give you a fashion makeover. Whoa, really? Heck yeah. You're going to have to claw the ladies off you. It'll be all thanks to me and my amazing taste. Uh, I don't know about this. Come on, I'll be fine. All you got to do is put the clothes on and tell us what you like, what you like better. You can start with mine. I got your sunglasses and a dragon print polo. Uh... You gotta be kidding me, Nikki. The kid's gonna be too shy at looking at damn me if you dress him up like that. Really? I thought fashion was all about standing out looking badass. Oh, he's gonna stand out, right? Like a sore freaking thumb. Shut up! He's better than American bullshit. Hmm. Don't worry, mister. I got the solution to all your guilt troubles right here. Okay, what is Uncle Ricky? Oh, come on. We're not gonna... You're not gonna try it? Fuck you! Man, you gotta love this. Ta-da! Short jacket, baggy pants, and of course, you can't go anywhere without a nice old school bag. It's kind of squished, but who cares? Um. It's even worse than mine. Come on, so I don't get it from when I was in junior high. Took a while to round it up. <laughs> All up, mind you. Girls go gaga with this bad boy stuff, trust me. You'll have to beat him off with a stick. Well, you want it, right? You want it. No way. Huh? But, 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 don't you want to look cool? Yeah, so I don't, we're not taking your clothes, you old man. Nobody wears stuff like that anymore. Besides, why do I wear our junior high, high clothes? I'm still in elementary school, stupid. I gotta take the things over cosmic down. Fuck yeah! Yeah! Dragon time! Heh! Ha ha ha! Who's behind the times now, Ricky? I haven't seen clothes that, like that in years. Not like you did any better. Don't be like that. You lost fair and square to me, an old timer. Why don't you go get changed, uh, Mr. Alright, but I'm not feeling this. E not really feeling this either. Shut up! It's gonna look great! Just try it on! It's gonna change up your vibe sometimes. You say so. Dance, 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 bow, burr. Oh my god, look at this. Look at all this little fucking Chad. Oh uh, yeah, this kid fucks. <laughs> Jesus. He sure is cool, feels kind of not. He's gonna come out here and be like, oh my god, look at this stud. Hey, you like a yaksa training. I don't think it's that bad. And hey, doesn't the dragon print make you feel closer to your uncle Kaz? I've got a dragon too, carved into my fucking skin. It's always dragons with you, Nikki. <laughs> Yeah, yeah it is. All right, Masuo, get over there and show Rihanna what you've got. Okay. Hey, baby. <laughs> Goes over there, fucking headbusters. Ah, oh my God, what the hell? What? Well, just do what you do, El Cacos. No, no, that's a no-no. You go sit the time out. Rihanna's like, it's fine, it didn't hurt. Masuo head headbutts like a little bitch. And then she headbutts him back and knocks him the fuck out. Oh, okay, we're fine. Hey, Rihanna, I couldn't find anyone else who wanted to go to the movie with me, so... Are you sure you don't want to come? Uh, what are you wearing? I went to a dead in a movie theater with a guy dressed like that. Anyway, I already said I had plans. Right. F fuck this bitch. Look at her. Look how weird she walks, right? I don't care if all the other kids walk that way, all right? It's dumb. She had a flat rejected and insulted a boo. Yeah, seriously. What in the fuck? Hey. Hey. We're going to talk to her. He's just not in me, Uncle Kaz. Damn it. The dragon should have worked. Fuck her. All right? She's a little bitch. All right? You're a dragon. Do you just keep telling yourself that every night before you go to sleep, all right? You're a motherfucking dragon. Fuck everybody else. They don't see that. Uh, Uncle Kai. Shut up, God damn it. Ah! And he goes and flips over one of the tables. Like, ah! I'm sorry that we're not talking about me anymore. Hey, you can't give up on some one small failure. You have to keep trying, Mitsuo. Maybe, but I think she likes this guy, Okada, for my class. 
You just have to prove you're better than him. You're gonna have to beat the shit out of him. Let me teach you how you eat actions. What? But he's really cool, and his dad's super rich. But you don't even know if he likes her. Can't ignore how you feel, Mitsuo. Huh? Well, you like her, right? Yeah, I really like her. But actually, I'm starting to like these, these aviators even more. Hell yeah, I'm a man. Then you know what you need to do. You're right. I'm not going to give up. You know, I should go grab Taichi. He said he'd see the movie with me if Ryona didn't want to go. Yeah, glad you have someone to go with. Now go beat the shit out of him. Shit, Mitsuo couldn't get Ryona to go with him. But I guess you'd have other plans. I should head to town and keep an eye on Mitsuo and Taichi. Huh. Interesting. Ah, hey, he's at. I can't believe it. He's so sad. That's right. Ha ha ha! I just done. What's up, Riona? I saw you being a little asshole to Mitsuo earlier. Fuck you. He's a dragon. Dragons are cool. Do you know where Harakachan is? I need to talk to her. Probably out shopping for groceries if she's not home. Huh? But are you now? What's the rush? Well, I'm gonna go hang out with some friends from school, so I was trying to make a, a bento. But I can't figure out how to make a uh, do Akashi. Do you know the mashed tar, tar with pork? I don't even know what that is. I've definitely seen Haruka Chan make it before, but I can't find her anywhere. Do you know how to make it, Okakaz? More or less. I'm not local, but I can manage. Really? Come on, teach me. Let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. All right. All right, I'm coming. Go out. Just one thing to another, huh? So, think you understand? Yeah. Thanks, Okakaz. I didn't realize you could make stuff that wasn't curry. I didn't either, honestly. Oh, look at that fucking brown stain to the right. I gotta, I gotta do something about that. That's just gonna bug me all day. Guess my menu has been a bit limited at times. Anyway, go have fun. Stay on the street, okay? Mm-hmm. Uh, what's the point of that? Oh, wait, wait. She, no, she's gonna, she's gonna be making this food for somebody, right? Game match just Mutsuo. Oh. oh. Hi, Rihanna Chan. What are you making that ben bento for? Are you gonna go on a date? Uh -huh. Yeah, though it's not, it's not gonna be just us. Is it with Mitsuo? Uh -huh. What? No? Smelly loser? Oh, well, I think you two should be, should be, we'll be good together. You know, he's kind of immature sometimes, but you'd be happy with him, Rihanna Chan. I like how, by the way, like, this is the, they're, they're in that weird, awkward phase, um, probably like, sort of nearing the end of elementary school right where all the girls are taller than the boys <laughs> it's like you can see how much taller she is this is actually super this is perfectly realistic all right because there is this, uh, the girls get a, a, a growth spurt usually earlier than the boys so there's a point where all the girls are just taller than the boys be happy with them Rihanna chan look it's not gonna happen rarica chan i just can't see myself dating a black guy What? Rhea, Rihanna, John. Sorry, that came out wrong. What? What did she say? What? Huh? Yaksa 3, are we actually going here? What? Oh my god. And we have to go. Oh my god. Sounds like she doesn't like Misuo because she's different. That's not how I raised her. Holy fuck! What the? <laughs> Sorry, that hit me like a fucking ton of bricks. I was not expecting that. That. Wow! What the heck? We don't need very right into me. Daichi. Huh? Oh, hi, Kukas. Are you supposed to be at the movies with Misuo? I was gonna go, but then he told me it was some gross love story. <laughs> I was there with him. Fucking weirdo. Where is he now? I don't know, he just kind of walked off. Didn't look too happy. Do you, do you remember which direction he went in? Pretty sure it was over towards downtown. Oh, I bet he's gonna go see the movie by himself. Hmm, so I should check up on him. Holy fuck! Oh my god, this got insanely, disgustingly real. Oh my god. Oh, oh. <laughs> I hope Mr. was okay. My bad. <laughs> I thought it was something like, oh, maybe, maybe she's like a bit older than him, and it just seemed like, in addition to the fact that she's like, you know, two feet taller than him. My God, no! Wah! Hope it's okay. My best bet would be to head downtown, see if I can hit him off. Wait, where is he? Specifically? I don't see any mark on the map. Oh, there he is. There he is. What's he doing over here? Hey, Mit. Wait. That's Riona. Must be her, her friends from school. What's your next, Katakin? I'll go anywhere as long as you're there with me. 
Oh, my dad's a hotel pretty close here with a big pool. Maybe we can go for a swim. Wow, sounds amazing, a cocoon. Yeah, I've never been in a hotel pool before. Um, some Romeo John? No, it's, it's nothing. Oh uh, yeah, Brianna has that gross bear in her arm. It's probably too much of a whim to go in the pool because then everyone be able to see it. Oh my God, what the hell? These kids are savage. Wait, is it really that gross? I want to see, come on. Stop it, please. Oh fuck, yeah. miss your time. Oh my god. That's a real that's a bad burn. Fuck. Oh <laughs> yeah. Go, Mitsuo. Get him. Curb stomp him. Got him! Ah! Punches his head clean off. Ow. Oh, my beautiful face. Wow, what a bunch of assholes. でも別に後をつけてたわけじゃなくて通りかかったら偶然だ大丈夫かみつおは気持ち悪くないのなな何をやけどそそんなの全然だよそれはリオナにとっては大きな悩みかもしれないけど Oh. oh my god. Dude, what the hell, man? Dude, this story got really fucking real. Holy shit. Oh my god, man. Oh. Aw. I liked that ending, though. That was a sweet ending. Holy fuck, dude. Jesus, I'm reeling from that. I'm <laughs> just like, ah! <coughs> Ow. Sorry, a little more. Huh? What's going on? Looks like Masuo didn't need your help after all, bitch. <sighs> Not like your suggestion was any better. Did you say something? Nope. Nothing at all. Ha. <laughs> By the way, Ricky, you should probably go grab your bags. Our flight's pretty pretty soon. Or you should go bring our bags. Uh, oh, she doesn't sit. You're right. Let me head home real quick, and I'll be back before you know it. See you in a bit, Nikki. <laughs> Yee! Sorry, Ricky. This has to be a one-man job. Uh, where's our things to turn out? But it looks like Rio understands Masuo's feelings. Wow. I, okay, well, that was, I'm, you know, it's kind of nice. It's actually, it's, I'm noticing now each of the kids, the, the orphanage is kind of getting like a little story, right? Which is kind of, which is pretty neat. What'd you say? Go, Jason, your turn. Hey, I'll go, so some baseball. Guess I do have a little time before I, where I have to go. All right, just a bit, okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm pumped. Let's go. Hey, guys. Look, God's going to play with us. We stay out the beach, okay? Don't make us wait. Baseball boys, baseball girls. Move out. <laughs> that was a sane run. <laughs> Fluffy's coming too. Oh boy, here we go. What's wrong, mommy? You don't want to play? Take me out to the ball game. Man, I swear to God, if you beat the nuts one more time, it's up. I'm going to hit you with the nuts. <sighs> Who is that? Sad boy. Guys, look, it's Amori. 
See, I told you all my last place cross over at some point. He just fades away. Ah! <laughs> hmm. I don't recognize that kid. But more importantly, it's the box over to the side. I gotta go check and see what's in there. Hey, you live around here? Y yeah. Cool. I'm Koji. What's your name? It's Akira. Akira fucking. Oh, God. That Akira? Quiet demon child. Ah! Uh oh. Well, Akira, you want to play with us? You know how to play baseball, right? I, um. Come on, it'll be fun. Yeah, let's play. But I've never played before. I bet I'm really bad at it, just like I'm bad at everything else. P is the only time I play sports, even then I always get picked last. Don't worry, we'll teach you. But we're just saying how we need another guy. Come on. Huh? We've got two girls and five boys, so one more boy even out, it, we'll even out the, the teams. Right, Taichi? Ah. Yeah, we love you, Jonas. Yeah. Some of the other kids are, are pr pretty young, too, so it won't go too hard, I promise. All right, me just, uh, I can play a little bit. Let's go. Man, these kids, these kids are basically teaching themselves life, life lessons. I'm not doing dick. I'm not doing dick, mommy. And neither are you. What do you get to do other than be adorable? Ah, I wish I could pet you. Uh... Okay, am I playing baseball still? Hold on. Guys, hold on. I gotta get I got this box over here. Uncle Cash, come on! Shut up! Alright, you gotta see what's in here. Gonna be some more tank materials for me to mod my weapons with. Tell me murder folk. It's just a worm! Damn it! That's the most reasonable thing I've found in one of these boxes so far. A worm. This case gonna be a fucking god, alright? Watch this. It's gonna nail the shit out of this thing. Hey, Uncle Cash, it's our new friend in Kirakun. Hello. Looks like you guys are having a fucking blast. Yeah, we're teaching Kira Kun how to bat since he's never played baseball before. It's not going so good, though. I know, Uncle Koss. You and some balls, and we'll try to catch them. Sound fun, right? Yeah, yeah I don't mind taking a few swings. How am I even doing the batting cages thing? Awesome. Come on, Kira Kun. Let's get some fly balls. Okay. Oh, yes, I am. Okay, hopefully this plays just like all the other times we've done this. First left stick controls, R1. Oh, okay. You can say. <laughs> you can say. Take them out of these balls, kids. Uh, X to the right time, hit the balls with Miss, uh, that Mitsuo throws to you. Hit 10 balls to finish field uh, fielding practice. Help the kids practice their fielding by hitting the balls that Mitsuo throws to you. Do I aim it at all? <laughs> That's cute. Oh, God. Whee! <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> ah, it takes me back a bit. This takes me back a bit to, like, I used to play some baseball when I was a kid as well. Or play something with, like, my dad. Oh, shit. Whoopsies. Damn it. I just throw the ball and then just chase out. Like, ah! Gonna nail some kid right in the face. Oh, damn, these kids keep tripping. <laughs> Look at them. Koji and, and Mosharige back there, just like. Uh, uh, uh. Uh oh, watch that, Shiba. Yeah. Yosh. Yeah. Where do the balls keep going? I guess, I guess that's the ball, the one ball we're just getting it back every time. Nailed it. Get it, Shiba! Mommy! Yeah, I definitely see the dramatic angle where you can see that I'm actually hitting a hitting a home run, technically. Yeah, that, like that. Yosh. <laughs> Yosh. <laughs> Just here, carry the back. Yosh. Yo, I'm the best. I mean, funny. Miss was like throwing these like fucking hundred mile per hour pitches. Like holy shit! Yeah, that was a good workout. Well, Kira Kun, that was pretty fun, huh? Yeah. And we're done warming up. Time to play for real. For real? For real? Yeah, we don't have enough people 
Feel for a gamer or anything. Look at just a bad anyone else place to fit. Where should we put a Kirakun? How about right field? It's pretty for it's for beginners. Good idea. Everyone, let's get in position. Wait, what's right field? Uh, Seriously? You don't know? Hmm. Lay off him, Tai Chi, you big fat fuck. It's his first time, remember? It's feet on the right, stupid. Right field's over there, pretty far from the batter. Stand by back there and get the ball if it comes your way. Then throw it to Mitsuo, okay? You'll be fine, Akira Kun. All right. Oh, well, you need a little confidence. Just gotta believe in yourself. Akira, just believe in yourself. Anyway, I'm gonna head inside for a bit. Keep an eye on, a co on him, Koji. Ah. Pluto, get, let's get you in position, Akira Kun. And scatter. Okay, I guess I'm heading in. Back inside I go. Uncle Kaz! Kirkun, he... He's fucking dead. Eh. Gotta empty the leg. Baseball, what in the fucking balls were you thinking? Do you hear me, young man? Go! <gasps> Why oh, Kara Charles the fragile boy? He can't be playing sports with you old ruffians! Jesus Christ! We're just getting ripped up by all these fucking randos today. God! Lay, get the fuck out of here! You damn dirty orphans, you! What happened, Koji? Well, um, Kirakun tripped in his head when he was right after the fly ball. <laughs> he tripped in another one of those boxes that washed the shore with random items. <laughs> damn it! I thought I got them all. Running! Does my Kara Charles look like the boy who runs? Oh, demon, dare you! Damn, his leg looks fucked up, too. Like, oh, wait, now it's just kind of the angle. But his, his left leg looks like it's kind of, like, bent in an awkward angle. Like, eh. I don't see why not. Does he have some kind of health conditions that keeps him from exercising? Well, no, but baseball's absurdly dangerous. I can't believe you would let your children play it unsupervised. How dangerous can it be with a rubber ball and a plastic bat, you stupid crazy bitch? Besides, no, totally all for kids their age would be playing sports on their own. It's okay, Uncle Kass. It's all my fault. I made Kira can do it. Uh, hello, what's going on here? Yeah! Oh, God, it's this guy. Oh, Miyamura. Miyamura-san. I rushed over. Wait, what, what, what voice did I give him? Oh, yeah, I, th I think I didn't get the snooze. Oh, Miyamura-san, I rushed over as soon as I heard what happened to your son. I'm terribly sorry. Sorry isn't good enough, Hashimoto-sensei. Just what are you teaching these children, hmm? The school board is going to hear about this. I can promise you that. School's like to do with it. What's this, do what's this douche doing back here? <sighs> Why is it that you always seem to be the center of my problems, Kiwi-san? What was that? You want to die today? Wait, you know this brute, Hashimoto Sensei? Not exactly. He runs his orphanage, though. These foul tempered orphans of his caused quite the trouble for my son recently. <gasps> oh! What? This is impossible. They forced my poor sweet Akira chan to play that horrible game with them? I simply cannot stand for this. Oh, we sad. Well, what do you have to say for yourself, young man? The silly game was just an excuse to bully my innocent boy, wasn't it? No, 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 no! Coach, he's no bully. I was supposed to believe that after what happened to my Akira chan. Police! I want the police there! But bring as many police as you want. I'll kill them all. Yes, man, I'll call them right away. Eee. Don't worry, Akira chan. The nice cops will be here soon. Yeah, fuck the police. Goji kun. Kira kun. I'm so sorry. You guys let me play with you. Then I had to go mess it all up. It was fun though. Baseball. Eh, many dies. Maybe we can play again sometime. Once I get better. Of course. Are you guys listening to the adults listening at all? Baseball Karachan, what are you saying? You must have hit your head even harder than you realized. No, you must die now. You guys are pillows are smothering him. That was wrong, you lady. Don't you get any ideas about seeing these awful orphans again? I forbid you forever to come back here. They're not awful, mom. And they don't, didn't pressure me into playing with them. I wanted to, I wanted to. Don't you get tight, you get really nice. Way nicer than the other kids in my class. So don't be mean to them. But a Karachan! No, Mom. Everyone here gets along so well. Nobody ever bullies me. Not like at school. What? You're being bullied at school? Sometimes. By who? Tell me his name now! Tell me! Probably his son, right? <laughs> yep. Masaka! Masaka! Your demons are... きりと言わないとあなた。いや、これは。あなた教師ですよ。実際子供にどんな教育をしてるの？早くよくなってよ。まだまだいっぱい教えてやるから野球。I will fucking kill you, veteran! 
You got him! Oh my god, she's chasing after him. Oh, that's a helicopter mom if I've ever seen one. She didn't mean, mean what she said, Koji. Don't want to get to you, okay? She's a bitch, all right? Everybody knows oh. it. Oh, well, especially because I made a new friend out of it. Yeah, that's one way to look at it. You're a good kid, Koji. Koji! Okay. All right, everybody have a good start core, start character arc? Everybody, we all good? <laughs> Is your flight still going to Yeah. Right, we said that like 30 times now. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. So let me know when you're going to leave, okay? I'll get the others to come say goodbye. Or are you leaving now? Uh, not quite. Not quite. Still some things to do around town. Okay, want me to come with you? What? Yeah. Of course I do. Can't exactly go swarm without you, can I? Yeah, yeah, let's, yeah, let's go. Dope. Uh, so I need to do the, the sky. Sky. So funny, Uncle Kaz. Oh, what's up? The sky. Ha ha. Wait, can we do, do, do you still hold my hand if I we walk? <laughs> Yay, cute. Even if she does the goofy, goofy ass walk that all the other kids do now. Damn it. I told you. All these, you gotta, stop, you gotta ignore these kids, all right? Actually, I wonder if she'll get a sub story then. Or some sub stories now she's with me. I bet I will. All more reason to do these now, because otherwise I probably missed my chance. I actually wonder if there's any like bonding with her here as well, you know, where like I increase her like her rank or whatever. Or is that just in Kamarocho? And here's the uh, thing that uh, Akira-chan cracked his head on. Let's see what's in there. Nothing. He died for nothing. Come on, Parko. I'm not even running that fast compared to other games. <laughs> it kind of sucks. This is like... Wait. What are you doing? <sighs> Uh-oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Yes, we do. And she's doing it. Oh, God. Do I want to do it? It's a fucking golf course. How many holes do we have to do? Get at least plus two in competition mode. Do it! Do it now! Oh my god. Okay. It's 5,000 yen, okay. Oh god. Well, maybe this will count towards also having to play for that other sub story. Maybe. Uh, no. Probably not, because she's actually here with me. Oh, God. Do I have to play all? Do I have to play full nine set? God, I hope not. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't go anywhere. I failed. I forgot how to play. <laughs> the controls weren't what I remember that what I thought. I was like, oh wait, I have to hold the button down. I was letting go of it too quickly. So you're gonna want to go back there again. Yep. So I gotta step out and go back. I don't know. The golf one might be too difficult, at least for yes. right now. <laughs> it's kind of funny that she goes down the course with me though. There we go. Oh fuck. I can, go can I go through trees? Probably not. Shit. Bogey. This is definitely going to take some getting used to. Oh, fuck you. Oh, my God. What? Please. Triple bogey. Oh, this is bullshit, man. This shit is not going to happen. Par. I'll take it. Mm. Shit. Hey. Oh my god. What am I doing? Huh? Oh fuck. It didn't reset it. Fuck you. Oh my god, it's just fucking bullshit, dude. 
I'm just going through this like I should try it out a bit, but this just this is not gonna happen, man. This is this is ridiculous. Oh, what the fuck? All right, can I just do that uh like ten more times? All right, I'm a plus thirteen. I can totally salvage this. Birdie. Okay, I'm actually starting to get the hang of it now towards the end, but still, uh, yeah. All right, let me try. I'm gonna try one more time. I was, I was like, first I was like, this shit seems impossible, but then towards the end, I sort of started to get it a little bit better. Hmm. Fuck. Hmm. Fuck you, dude. Hmm. Fuck. Hmm. Oh, this is so bullshit. I hate you so much. Hmm. God, please just get in the hole. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Fuck. Love to have made that. Hmm. Good. Oh my god, okay, I need I need to make a birdie on here if I actually want to get this. Hmm. Fuck you, dude. Hmm. No. Oh, I almost got it. Fuck, man. Shut up, Arga. Uh, I don't see any new ones popping up. Let me see. Huh, interesting. There actually is a sub story for, uh, with, with, with Haruka, but I actually don't get it till after I put my suit back on. So, and we haven't done that yet. So I guess I must have another chance to do some shit with Haruka. Yeah, actually looks like I currently can't do anything with Haruka. So I'm gonna need to do alone. Stay here. Hey, now a new one's popped up here. Okay. What up, kids? Uh, Man, it's a boy right now. I'm hungry. Uh, nothing fun we do. Well, they're smelling a TV, and I checked all the channels. I must have read my manga a thousand times, too. Hey, uh, dude, let's pick up a game. Come on, be fun. Hey, kids. What are you three up to? Nothing. It's a problem. We're probably down to boredom on cars. Oh, yeah? They got plenty for you to do. Uh, Clean up around the house. You're just going to have us do chores on cars. Even doing nothing is better than that. What about your homework then? <laughs> you already finished it. Every last page. Uh, uh, I got it. Why don't we play hide and seek? Oh, cars can be it. Hmm. That's something I haven't played in ages. Fuck you. Sure, why not? Sure, why not? It's good for you guys to play outside. <laughs> yeah, oh, good God, yeah. I don't trans. We just came out together. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm gonna chase you the fuck down. I'll go get Eric John too. We'll go play together. It's been so, but while and ship, and it might be nice to go outside too. Yeah, uh, by the way, guys, it's we start crying if you find her too quick, so try to stay for last, okay? Got it. It's nice for you to look out for her like that Tai Chi. Hey, well, I'm basically a big brother around right here. Gotta make sure everyone's staying happy. <laughs> okay, Eric John's here. Is everyone else coming? Uh, nope. I found Erica. I found good for Erica, John. And everyone else is busy or cooking or something. Oh. Hey, uh, is we chunk? Can we hide together? No, it's not. Oh, Gus was fast in a millisecond. <laughs> okay, when you let hide inside in the front yard. Oh, Gus, here we kindly got the jam while we all hide. Everyone got it then. Our marks is go. One, two, three more. I look down and hide. Turn right on. I'm fucking cover you. You're all gonna die today, kids. Once you find one of the kids, press R3 to switch to a first person view make your presence known by looking directly at them leave no child left behind but if you want to call it quits simply walk out more glorious for simply just run leave <laughs> where did i go i just leave <laughs> a cost me eight hours to fabby it okay um it's like hide behind this fucking door okay so we're gonna save the ease me for last which is not stupidly easy to see where you at, kids? Where the fuck are you? Don't make me come over there. Oh, hey, I can go to the backyard. Cool. I didn't know that. Is everyone back here? Uh, I don't think so. We're a good place for them to hide, too. <laughs> All right, no, no, this is existed. Until just now. Uh, okay. There's Mitsuo. Hey, what's going on in here? Oh, we're making dessert. Late next door, we have a lot of fruit, so we're making gelatin to make it something tasty. 
We're making pudding too. It's delicious to you too. By the way, you didn't notice anyone hiding Grinder, did you? No, I don't think so. We well, play hide and seek. Just guess the rules to ask for help. Right, this old cows forgot to guess the rules sometimes. Damn it. Damn these kids. Should throw them all out back out on the street. Let me get out of this fucking house so I can start running. Uh, okay. So we'll look around. Uh, is that. Okay, yeah, that's definitely easy me in the worst spot possible, of course. Alright, so you're. I'm gonna save you for last. No, 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 keep playing. Okay, so not. They're not going down to the beach. They're literally around this whole building. Are they still in here? Guys, <laughs> she's hanging from the ceiling like a fucking ninja. Yeah, that's right. That's right, Uncle Kai. You're never gonna find me. You're never gonna find me. Shoot, but where could everybody be? Rough. Oh. I see you. Aha, it's supposed to be Eerie. Gotcha! Gotcha, Eerie. Uh oh, Brett! Ah! I was way too quick on cost. I wish I could stay hidden a little longer. Sorry, that's part of the game. Now to the next one. Aha! Okay, uh. Taichi and, and uh, Shiro. I haven't found anybody else. Why did I find this worm here? See on the, oh my God, he's on the fucking roof. It's definitely Taichi. How do you even get up there? Gotcha! Gotcha, Taichi! Huh? Get your fat ass down here. Ah, oh, man, they were never gonna find me. Stop. Wow, you better sit down, guys. How'd you find me up there? Oh, you know, I have a lot of practice when I was a kid. But hey, you win some, you lose some. On to the next one. Okay. Uh, is it possible that he's over on the... Actually, no. I, I looked over there and I, I can't actually... I couldn't go into my first person camera on that side. Uh, is he still in the house? Is he over here or something? Oh, hey. Oh, hey, another locker key I, I missed. Is he in here? Uh, nope. Oh, there he is. So Shiro, I see. Gotcha! Gotcha, Shiro. What? This spot never failed me before. <sighs> You're great, this old cost. No one's ever seen me back there. Yeah, guess he learned something about, new about me today. Well, on to the next one. All right. And finally, Izumi. The easiest one to find. Because I found Izumi. Gotcha, what? Izumi. What? Yet you found me? Mm. Oh, now this game is so still, too. You had a great hiding spot, he's to me. That's why it took me so long to find you. So long. Anyway, let's go meet up with the others. It was impossible. What the fuck? Well, I found everybody. Did y'all enjoy yourselves? Uh, yeah, I thought we made it pretty tough for you, but I guess not. <laughs> that was the very last one. Didn't I do a good job hiding, Uncle Cass? You sure did, he's to me. You, you were the best. <laughs> you, Uncle Cass. That's what you would never. No problem. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? Was it fun playing together with everyone? Let's do this again sometime. Probably perhaps it won't be easy easier. Heh, <laughs> hope ah. not. Come on, Mr. Steady Seagull, you little guys. I got experience from that ex from that experience. Oh my god, hey, there's another one. Ah. Come on, sit, mommy. What? Woof? Sit, sit. Oh, what you do when I sit? What's up, easy me? What are you trying to do? Oh, hi, cuz. Try to teach your mommy to sit, but he won't listen to a word I say. That's because you gotta give dogs rewards when you're training them. Otherwise, the message won't stick. Huh? Okay. So, cuz, why don't we train mommy together? You want both of us to teach them the same at the same time? Sure. Sure, why not? I'll help you teach mommy to sit. All right. Okay, let's go. Now, let's see. Sit. Sit. Wow, you got a first try. <laughs> Arf. Good dog. Uh, why would you do what I tell you? Huh, why don't you give it a rest for now? Mommy looks pretty worn out. Go strike in later. What? Oh. It's like a multi one? Just won't do it. Uh. Sure. Did we just keep doing it again and again? Sit. Oh, he didn't do it this time. But what do you... What do you do? You turn around. Uh, uh oh. I'll see. Uh. I swear, I didn't even give him a treat last time. Uh, make him try again. Sit. There we go. Good boy. Now you get a treat. Mommy, you did it. You really sit. 
<laughs> Whimper. Let's see. Give him a treat. Pity on Costa. Go remember how to see if we give him a treat now. So I lost it. What the hell? He was what? We did one time. He's like, he's got to be worn out. Here it goes. Okay, shit. I thought that was a glitch. That was even kind of unusual. Good job, Mama. You really got it down. It's probably the best. You can sit perfectly now. Thanks, Uncle Luck. Cause I want you some lots more tricks. You'll see. Help me, right? Sure. I was, okay, that was easy. Are we, uh, oh yeah, we are still going. Try Mama Charm, but you won't do it. Try real one to learn this. Okay. All right, turn around. They probably sit, right? Oh, wait, no, he did it. Good boy. Oh, you did it. You had to turn around. <laughs> Whipper. Oh, give him a treat. You did, good boy. As a very obedient Shiba. Chapo, you really got down. <laughs> and we're done. More 2,000 more experience. Okay. Okay, fetch. I'll see. Fetch. Fetch. Not quite. Don't you see it? <laughs> oh. Okay, uh, try again. Fetch. No, not quite. I don't, even have, I don't even have a fucking toy or anything, do I? Okay. Try again. No. Not yet. <laughs> I feel like I'm confusing this poor animal. Okay. Fetch. Do I, do I have to give him like a toy or something? Oh, there he goes. He never came back. He just got sick of my shit. Yay! Good boy. Give him treat. There he goes. Back he comes. Good boy. All right. Yay. Three hours experience. Sit. Look. Wolf. Turn around. Fetch. Oh, boy. They're going to wait for him to run down there again. Where's he finding these sticks anyway? Great job, Bobby. You're amazing. Thanks, little cos. Now Bobby can hold his head up high around all these doggy friends. What's that? You want to give him give to Uncle Kaz? What was the boy? <gasps> stop it on Spark! You fetched a stop it on Spark for me? How did you know? How did you know? And what do we have here? See, press for Mame. He wants to thank you for helping him get, get so smart. I see. Thanks, Mame. <laughs> woof, woof, woof. Ah, uh, good boy. Who's that good boy? Yes, I love you too. Uh, yes, I can upgrade. All right, last one. Uh, S is a fear. So your move that catches enemies off guard. Holding your weapon is enough to strike that phone to your your foe. Fear into your foes. Uh, essence of head bashing. Take out two enemies by smashing their heads together. Yeah. Effect depends on enemy enemy sizes. Uh, grab an enemy, and press triangle near other enemies. That's a good one. Uh, extra heat attack. An additional a attack for heat actions using walls, platforms, and super finishes. Sick. Extra heat. Okay, I don't see any new ones that have shown up now. Uh, there. Okay, I think it's probably a good time to check and see, like, what do, what do I have left at this point in the game? Okay, nope. I've gotten all the ones I can currently get. There are actually two with Haruka. But I've gotten all the ones I can do aside from the ladies at the club. So, all right. Let's go ahead and try that out just to see what it entails for the hostesses. Um, and if it ends up being something like, okay, this is some super basic bitch shit, right? Like, like all of them are like the exact same. There's nothing to it. Then I'm just gonna, uh, do some off screen. And then like, apparently it's, it's, it just goes like the other ones, right? Where you reach a certain point and then, uh, you, uh, have a sub story with them and that, and that's it. Right. Um, all right. Flawless. Hey, yes, I am here. 
Stress a, a specific hostess. Oh, we'll just start from the top. Mika Suchia. Uh, Mika san, then, then right this way, sir. Oh, this is actually the chick that I ran to before, isn't it? So I guess these are real porn stars, right? Just like the, all the other times. <laughs> That's stilted voice acting. Nice to meet you. Let's have some fun, okay? Sounds good to me. What you like? Uh, the most expensive, yes. Golden Champagne. I'm just gonna have some, some of this shit. I'll have this. Do you could like that? It's kind of surprising, actually. Is that best thing to eat? Uh, fruit platter. Why not? <laughs> it's just one of my favorites. See my thing. Right away. Oh god, I actually have to watch the order animation too. I'll get the star for you. Sure. Here you are. Thank you. Cheers. Tempeh. Cheers. How much booze they have in a single night, I wonder. I wonder if they even drink at all, really. Smoking. Do we talk at all, or? Kirsten, you're from Tokyo, right? In a broad sense, yeah. Cool, I'm actually from Tokyo, too. Really? What part? I used to live in Narima. I grew up in Kanag Kanagawa, where my family lives, but I moved to the city for work. I still spent more than a few evenings living up in Kamurocho. Is that so? Yeah. Kamurocho's great. So it's something new and exciting to do, no matter the time of day. The city never sleeps. Yeah, right about that. I have to admit, though, I do miss Tokyo. Uh... How would you end up in Okinawa? How long are you here for? Did you come here? Did you come by here by yourself? Uh, how'd you end up in Okinawa? Hey, everyone asks me that. It's because I, I look like I'm not from around here. You with the flower in the tent. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Well, I like to tell people that I was completely enchanted by the warm tropical sun and the beautiful clear ocean. I just couldn't leave them behind. Not too hard to believe. Kisa, okay, so have you had any trouble understanding the words and phrases they use here in Okinawa? A little, yeah. You here have all sorts of words and phrases that I couldn't even start to understand. For example, they refer to themselves and main letters totally differently. Right. Take, uh, oh god, Shima, Shimanchu and Uchi Nanchu, for example. I knew Shima meant island, and I, but the rest completely bewildered me. How, the first time I heard someone refer to themselves that way, I was completely lost. Yeah, I was totally confused by that at first. What else? Oh, they call trash cans Chiribako instead of gum, Gomibako. Dust cans instead of trash cans. I think that's really, I think that's really cute. Oh, I thought of another thing. In Tokyo, I'm pretty much everywhere else. When you leave work, you kind of have to apologize for not being the last one to leave, right? But here in Okinawa, they aren't formal about it at all. They are just saying, okay, I'm out of here, bye. It's a pretty drastic difference, yeah. I've really taken interest in all the little language, different languages here in, in the mainland. I'll tell you some more if you'd like. <laughs> that's enough for me. Uh, I'm learning a whole lot. I'd love to hear more. Uh, I'm learning a whole lot. Yeah, I'm learning a whole lot. It's a lesson. Hey, you're quite welcome. Feel free to ask me about the cool Okinawa words any time. I love talking about them. Will do. Hey, you can use that after you tell me more about yourself, Kiyo son. Sounds like a plan. It's time, time for us to wrap things up. Okay. A card. So I was talking to you. Hope you had a good time. Definitely. <gasps> Mika Suchia. I got her business card. Cool. I will remember this day forever. Uh, oh my god, my bill! Fuck! Uh, we hope to see you again. Now then. Watch your step. Okay. Cool. Uh, I seem to go fine. What the hell is that? I've got a message. Thanks for requesting me, isn't it? Okay, no, wonderful. Hope you had lots of fun. Here I'll carry you, son. Love you. I love you too. Okay, um. Yeah, it was, I mean, it was, that was definitely pretty okay, but not anything super special. Um, let's go, let's just keep going with it a little bit and see if it develops anymore. I mean, I'm just guessing it's not, since, you know, based on what you guys were saying, but, but let's see anyway. I want to see at least a, a decent amount of this one, or at least record a decent amount of it. Okay, so the hearts stay up there. Uh, Shaq, your son, I guess I'm a fan. 
Should I give a gift? Uh, shouldn't I? Oh, well, oh, the outfit I'm wearing? Fuck you. I like my outfit. It actually went down, too, after that. No. Fuck you. Yeah, it's like the thing. I, I got the free thing. Cool. Check in. I like that too, Gary son. I got a slightly cheaper than the other one, too. See my saying? Switch, I love going out to, on town in the commemoration of the rest of Tokyo, too. Early not much time to party. I was always so busy with work. What'd you do for work over there? I was secretary over the president of a brokerage firm. Wow. I think you'd imagine how, much, how busy they kept me. After all things that, after all the things they had me do for the company, I feel like I came out of, of it as a jack of all trades. Sounds like a tough job. Get that right. It's about how busy it was. I did get a lot of valuable experience out of it. For example, I learned how to make reservations at so much shady restaurants. And how to lie about our company dealings with the president's <laughs> wife. To be honest, sometimes I found myself thinking, wait, should this even be part of my job? Uh, sounds like they kept you pretty busy. Secretary to the president, huh? Uh, what else do they have you do? What else do they have you do? So what other things did you do for them as a secretary? Let's see. Tommy Emmy lined up. Line up early outside of the department store to buy a limited edition toy that his grandkid really wanted. There even times when he made me go on dates with his most important clients. So it's awful. It was. So when I tell people I had to do all those things, they're always so surprised. Mm -hmm. But in spite of all the trouble I suffered through, I ended up getting a lot of relevant career level experience. Eh? <laughs> Glad it was worth it. So fun. Curious, have you heard of Okinawa time? Okinawa time? Is that like a special time zone? It, I guess you aren't in the know. Well, what, what is it then? No looking out with tradition, or at least that's what the locals say. Okay, what's it all about? So you plan to meet up with someone around noon. So they show up around 12, right? Well, they have Okinawa would say an hour later, or worse. That's Okinawa time. Really? That's a thing. Yes, really. Of course, there's our Nokoawans who like to be on time, but I think most days tend to show up on, on the later side. Oh, wait, I just realized. I, I said technically I've, I fished all of them except for the girls. Actually, it's not right. I have to do the golf the golf one, too. To my example, though, they won't show, me a, show up at 12, but they'll text you they'll text you at 12, and it won't and won't be what you'd expect. Guess, what do you think they say? Sorry, I'm going to be late. Nope. They'll ask, when, hey, when are you leaving? Really? I guess I'd be happy to get that text. Right, but so that's just how they do things in Okinawa. But like I said before, not even Okinawa one is like that. That's what usually happens around here. Uh, that's no good. Good to know. Must be the Okinawan way. Must be the Okinawan way. Well, Kiri san do you do those kind of things? Do those kind of things not bother you? Don't mind if people are late? Not sure, to be honest. But I can understand why living why living on the south might make people stop caring so much about being on time. Yeah, I tell you, get what you mean. That's what makes Okinawa such a nice place to live. Got that right. Kiryu san do you have any pets growing up? Oh, okay, we got a third one. Nope, never had one, actually. Hey, did I? When I moved to Okinawa, though, I had a, got a cat. But no idea how I was supposed to take care of him. He calls him Yanami. I always be up right back at him. <laughs> yeah, that's cute. I need tuna. Ugh. The reason's pretty silly. First time I fed him, I gave him canned tuna and just couldn't get enough of it. From that moment on, I started calling him my little tuna. Recently, though, tuna's gotten pretty real picky about his food. I only eat beef and chicken flavor and only expensive brand, too. What am I going to do with this cat? Sounds like a fussy feline. Yes, yeah, so it's taking a lot. I told my wallet. Tuna's a good name. What kind of cat is he? What a spoil cat. Uh, Tuna's a good name. Tuna's a good name. Hey, thank you, Kiryu son. I'm sure you'd be shocked as I, I was when I thought, saw him wolfing down that can of tuna. I swear. I think it was the first time he'd been fed in weeks. Sure, we sound like a sight to see. Well, she'd be more like his name. Go back to eating cheap cans of tuna. If it won't do it for me, at least do it for my wallet. Yeah. Could put stop, but I still have plenty of money. Should we keep going? Uh, stand session. Uh, can I get the same thing? Oh, oh yeah. It's free. And she likes it. Yes, I can. Okay, I can't extend it, which is good. Can't get enough of those chicken tenders. Oh god. Can't skip any of this. Good lord. Now move to Okinawa. There's a big difference between people here and the people from the mainland. What's that? People in Okinawa have completely different attitudes. Not sure how to describe it exactly. Because like the walls they put up between each other are much lower. Does that make sense? You can see it in the way they speak or how they approach one another. Straightforward about how they feel about pe about people. And they're so warm and friendly to everyone. You think so? I know so. When they walk down the street, they'll, they'll greet everyone, even strangers, with a friendly, Hey, what's up, brother? It's so sweet. They don't shy at all. When they talk to you, they make you feel like you've known them forever. There's this level of friendliness that you'd never see in Tokyo. Uh, it's a completely different culture. Maybe that's because you're from Tokyo. We could learn something from them. 
It's a completely different culture. It's a completely different culture here. Exactly. But all of Japan, but I've never seen one act like this. It's only something I've experienced while living here in Okinawa. Really? That's surprising. Every place is an upsize and downside, sure, but still. Uh, between the glittering ocean, the warm sun, and the kind people, I know that my decision to move Okinawa was the right one. Yeah, <laughs> glad you're happy. Do any sessing around Okinawa since you moved here? You know, I don't think I have. Except for the, you know, <laughs> the shit, the, the sub stories and stuff. If you ever go outside the city, you should definitely get a car. Monorail doesn't run outside the city, so you have really have no choice. Either car or bus. I'll remember that. A little bit far from the city myself, but I don't own a car. I own a bicycle. E. <laughs> bicycle must be good exercise. It is. My thighs, are, my thighs are nice and toned now. Oh, shit. For sorry, everyone was so shocked to hear that I bike to work every day. Mm -hmm. That's just shocked they were to see me walking out of the changing room in full-fledged gear at the end of the day. <laughs> Certainly don't see that every day. Signs that when I've had a little too much to drink, I give in and call taxis. I'm not that crazy. There's so many great reasons to ride a bike, though. It's environmentally friendly. It saves money. It's super fun. And the best of all, it's healthy for you. What kind of bicycle do you ride? Must be great for your health. Yeah. How long does it take you to get here? Uh, oh my god. Uh, what kind of bicycle do you ride? Ride a racing bicycle. Whoa, that's real, that's a real that's a surprise. I know, it's a little weird, right? No, not at all. Sounds pretty practical. Oh, thank goodness. I don't know what I would do. Don't tell me I'd look better on a girly cruiser bike with a big basket. <laughs> so you look good riding one of those two. Do you have any? Oh my god, okay, wow. So I got three on this too. Any hobbies? Not really, to be honest. Bus different from what you think. I'm really into bodyboarding. Wow, you're right. Never would have guessed that. I started doing it last uh, last year, but now I've gotten better at it. I'm just having so much fun. It's good to find a hobby you enjoy doing. That's for sure. Look, that's that side. Because I'm out out in the sun, bike surfing all the time. I got I've gotten really tan. Yeah, I can see that tan. You know, despite the stereotypes, you can still find some pale skin people here that's in Tokyo. That's true. If everyone seemed to buy into the stereotype that all oh, Okinawa's have dark tan skin. <laughs> Most are from another native Okinawa. A fur away with lighter skin. Yeah, that's got to be the right answer. I like a girl with a healthy tan. I probably, pro I probably make the same mistake. I like a girl with a healthy tan. Really? You bet. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking you might be into girls who are more pale cute, son. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know. Mm. So time for us to wrap things up. Okay. Well, we almost got into... Almost got into full hearts. Got past halfway after that. Hmm. Okay, so I am okay. seeing. Uh, I'll see you all again. See you again soon. So it's like it's not awful. Um, like I mean, we're getting some some I guess sort of cutesy lore. The thing is, I don't know. Like I guess maybe what makes the other ones better is that the fact that you also had this like overarching story with uh, the Cabaret Club mini game, right? That sort of went with it. I think that also made it help make the girls themselves even more endearing and made you want to learn more about them. Because of this, you just have the talking here and also the fact that there are literally 10 of these girls in this game. Fucking 10 of them. That's insane. That's fucking insane. I think I might do some of these off screen and just get to the sub story and then we'll show, I'll show you guys the sub story of each one. I hope that's okay. I just, I know I usually show like all of these all the way through, but I want to see you again. I think you really come again. Request me. I play. We got to talk. I love you. It's it's just like I kind of see what you guys mean though, where it's like a bit of a grind, and the grind actually is the fact that there's actually some of these animations that I can't skip over. Where like Carrie gets the food, and she's got to order the food, and then she's got to light my cigarette. Yeah, and the main thing is just like there are ten of these girls. Seriously, if I sat down and did this for literally all of them and showed all of them, it would take at least like three or four episodes, I think, for every single girl. Um, and, and, and based on this girl right here, her, her dialogue's okay. Like, I don't think it's dreadful or anything, but I'm not finding myself super engaged enough to where I'm like, yeah, I think you guys are really going to not be bored to death or bored to tears watching this. Um, at least, at least by the fucking, you know, third or fourth girl. So, yeah, I think I'm going to just off-screen grind this and get all the girls to make like their sub story and then we can just do all the sub stories for them at once so uh hopefully it's okay um i think i'm probably gonna do that th uh now then <laughs> and uh end things here for the time being and maybe i'll try to also I, apparently to get the the golf one this golf sub story i have to get 
a uh, even par on the golf course. It's actually even harder than Harakos. Fucking great. I might attempt that as well. Hopefully, whatever their sub story ends up being gives them a bit more character. It does seem like uh, I imagine at least that this that all the girls are gonna have different uh, different dialogue because. I can't imagine that every girl's going to be tan and be like, oh, I came from Okinawa and tan skin and boogity boogity. Boog boog so it's not like too super generic, you know, which is good. But again, 10 girls, man. Holy fuck. That's insane. That's a lot of porn stars. <laughs> um, but anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe if you're not ready to become Piggy Penguin aboard the SLP. Where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And, and let me know, you know, if you guys in, in the comments are like, Nico, no, we, we actually do want to see like all these girls or something. I I don't imagine that's the case, but maybe they're still alive. You're like, no, Nico, I do want, I want to see uh, all of your dialogues with them, uh, with all 10 of these girls from beginning to end. And I want you to record them. I might reconsider it, but I kind of think that's probably not the case. But if it is, let me know. Uh, anyway, guys, as always, till next time. Stay classy!